doesn't the Bible phrase unquenchable fire indicate that the fire never goes out? I mean, it says unquenchable. That means it burns forever and ever. Let's find out what the Bible says. Matthew chapter 3, verse 12. It says, He will thoroughly purge his floor and gather his wheat into the garner, but he will burn up the chaff with unquenchable fire. That sounds like a contradiction. Burnt up means all gone, but it says unquenchable fire. Stay with me. I'll explain it. Whenever you want to understand a phrase in the Bible, go somewhere else in the Bible to get an explanation. Let the Bible explain itself. Can you say amen? amen. This is not in your lesson, or it is in your lesson. It's not part of the answer. Revelation, I'm sorry, Jeremiah 17, 27. But if you will not hearken unto me to hallow the Sabbath day, and not to bear a burden, even entering in at the gates of Jerusalem on the Sabbath day, then I'll kindle a fire in the gates thereof, and it will devour the palaces of Jerusalem, and it shall not be quenched. Here it says devour. There it says not quenched. The palaces and the gates were devoured. They were burnt by Nebuchadnezzar because they did not repent of their sins. They are not still burning today. Unquenchable means it is not extinguished. Another scripture here, Mark 9, 47 and 48. If your eye causes you to sin, pluck it out. For it is better for you to enter into the kingdom of God with one eye rather than having two eyes to be cast into hellfire where the worm does not die and the fire is not quenched. Now let me explain this with an illustration and I hope this works. I've got a pack of matches here. Please don't contact the fire marshal. I've seen plenty of people smoking around this place. I'm sure I can do this. All right. Now, the fire is burning. It's not quenched. I'm not going to quench it. It's burning, trust me. I'm not going to quench it. Not going to, ooh, that's hot. Not going to quench it. I'm not quenching it. Not going to quench it. I didn't quench it. Is it burning? No. Quench is a verb. It means to extinguish. It's saying the fires, what's left? Nothing. Ashes. There's nothing left. I did not quench it. No one will be able to extinguish the fires of hell. There will be no fireman in hell running around putting the fire out. That's what the Bible is saying when it tells us that it is unquenchable fire. Okay. Okay. 